Welcome to the 11th tutorial on beginning CSS. In the last video we created an external style sheet and so we're going to go ahead and use that right now. So let's open up our website folder that we created and we'll go ahead and open up our style sheet. Now in this video we're going to be talking about the text decoration property and we dealt with that in previous videos but we're going to expand upon that in this video. So I want to go ahead and eliminate this class that we created, but before we do that, I want you to copy and paste this into the H1 and H2 selector. And actually, we're just going to copy and paste this over the border bottom rule that we set. We're not going to use that anymore. And then we'll go ahead and eliminate this class that we created in earlier videos. And we'll go ahead and save our style sheet now. And you can see that we have an underline on our H1 and H2 headers. So that is the first value that we can use. Now let's go ahead and close that out. Now another value that we can use is the line through parameter. So let's go ahead and put that in. And we'll save this. And let's go ahead and open up our HTML page and you can see we've got a line through our text now. Another parameter that we can use is overline. So let's type that in here. And we'll go ahead and save our style sheet again. Let's open up our page. And there you can see we get a line above the text. Now you can also combine some of the parameters. So let's put in here underline. And let's go ahead and save this. And you can see now we've got an underline and an overline. And then the final parameter we'll talk about is none. And that's pretty self-explicit. I don't think we need to show that. Um, let's actually set this back to underline because that's what we'll use going forward. And let's go ahead and save this and we'll take one more look at our web page and it's back to normal. Okay, I will see you guys in the next video.